What is up, you bastards? Thank God it's Friday. Let's get a uh, thumbs up for Friday. Friday live stream. Who do we have in here? We got Gerard. What is up? Happy Friday. Got uh, Ducky the Greaser. Waiting for the man of the hour. We got Brent. Ryan. Edgar. John. Bastard of the Week. By the way, I am currently right now um, filling, labeling, packaging the Chakra Colognes. The bottles finally came in a little while ago. So that's that's actually what I was doing until like, man, probably 145. And then I was like, oh crap, I got to start the live stream. So um gonna gonna try to get all of the pre-sales out and i think i'll i think i'll have maybe like five or six left that are just gonna go on the site you know for sale what's up edgar ken happy friday jp hey can is the audio good the my voice good background music not too loud give me a fire emojis if everything's good How many good on your end? Sweet. How many of you saw the little surprise Instagram little live thing that I did the other day? Um, had a package sent and it was freaking amazing. Is Brad in here? Brad, if you're in here, Give me like a whole bunch of fire emojis. So Brad customer sent me a care package that had a whole bunch of awesome. Um, these are newer, but a bunch of cigar boxes, like vintage ones, old school ones. Amazing. But the icing on the cake, he sent me this mug or this mug. I was reading mug. This glass right here, Brick House, Oktoberfest 2023. Awesome freaking mug, mug, glass, and a crap ton of cigars. I mean, it filled up my little desktop humidor. So here is, yeah, I did. Here is my little, oh shoot, my little desktop humidor that another customer got for me with my name on it, right? Everything's always backwards right here. Says Mr. Lux, but look at the cigars. All of these cigars, there's actually, there was a couple of duplicates. So I put in my other humidor downstairs, but each one of these is a different cigar. So Brad, if you're in here or you're watching this later, freaking, freaking thank you, man. That is awesome. So I think, well, probably since I'm using the brick house, I'm going to go with the brick house cigar. I always love trying new cigars. So this is, you know, I don't know how many are in here. Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different cigars. So ten different brand new. Never, never tried them before. This one says Brick House Classic. Don't mind if I do. Happy Friday, Derek. 
Mark. Dave, I picked up the 2024 mug and love it. Any chance older versions are available? Probably, ooh. Probably not right now, just because I want to try to do a bunch of the 2024s. Um, the lady that does the pottery for me, she's having some surgery done on her, I think it's in her hand or on her wrist because you know doing all of these things by hand i guess there's something going on with like your pinky so it's going to be a while before i have i already placed an order for another batch of the 2024s i think two dozen so i should have those i think end of april early may but after that it's going to be a minute before i can produce like any more of these glorious cigar ashtrays i also have a, two of the ones that have double cigar and a pipe holder those are on the site these are also on the site as well all right got my handy dandy v cutter 9000 you know what i'm gonna do a punch plug also has one built into the bottom Get out of there. There we go. Perfect draw. All right, let's light this thing up. Then I need to fill up my glass, my brick house. Nice, clean smoke. Not really picking up anything yet, but usually you got to get into the scar a little bit. What's up, Tom? Okay. So, some of you may know or may not, probably most of you don't, but literally right next door to me is a brewery. Off the grid brewery located out here in Apple Valley. I got hooked up with a, I think this is what, a Crowler? This is their Norsk. Probably not gonna be able to read that. Brewed um, or canned 419. So wow, today. So he did this for me today, 6.8%. He said that it's one of his favorites, the owner's son. That challenge coin is awesome too if you haven't checked it out. This one right here. This big boy. I mean look how look how big that is to the can. Sipping some new Belgium triple over here. Nice. I've never had this beer before. So mm, ooh. It immediately like activated those glands. Let's see how she pours. Oh, look at that. I'm making a mess already. I thought I had a towel over here and I almost grabbed one. When I was downstairs. Oh, I got a napkin. Always make a mess of it, I swear. Note to self get more paper towels. Now we're cooking with gas. 
So yeah, challenge coins are on the site. I think they're in the new section, so. Wedding is in October. Cheers to that. All right, happy Friday. Guinness. Haven't had a Guinness in a while. Looks pretty light. I'm getting the coriander note that he said that, or no, it was some kind of a tea, like a coriander tea. Happy Friday, Jason. All right. So cheers to each and every one of you bastards out there. Happy Friday. If you're here now or watching this later, make sure to hit the thumbs up button. You guys are freaking awesome. Cheers to that. Oh, wow. Very floral. Happy Friday, Steve. Man. That does not taste like 6.8%. <clears throat> Very light. Boy, this thing has some good, uh, looks off some good smoke. <clears throat> mm. Delicious. I missed it. What sticky smoking? These were sent to me by a customer brad i don't know if you saw the instagram the other day but i did a box opening of a bunch of awesome stuff that he sent me so this is the brick house classic which i got the matching glass to go with it love the uh, style it's very vintage very luxurious bastard style So, like I was saying, currently filling chakra colognes right now. Um, and I'm going to have also all the pre-orders, you, you know, anybody that's gotten the, that ordered it should be getting tracking information here. Then I think I have about five extra or so that are going to go up on the site. Just, you know, ready to go, ready to ship. Then I think as far as the next profile, it's a toss up between probably ombre I'm thinking either ombre. Hmm. I'm visually Looking at my ingredients. I know I can do ombre. I'll probably do ombre, honestly, because since that one's a staple. <clears throat> and I think it'll work very well in the spray cologne. So. Today's Friday. Uh, it's 2.14 over here. Maybe. Don't hold me to it, but I might be able to knock those out before i leave today so i'll if i do you'll know because if you go to the cologne or like on the new tab click on the colognes you will see the ombre profile but obviously i think once i get once i do it i'm going to take a, a picture and i'll post it up on instagram but those will be straight up, no pre-order. 
um, I should be able to have those done. And I already got a, I already have to order another batch of the uh, bottles too, because the pre-orders I think we got like fifteen or something like that. So crazy, it's gonna be good. I think ombre and the spray will will do quite well. After that, I'm I'm almost contemplating to do the Enigma. I don't know if you guys remember the Enigma profile. I think Enigma will, will work as well. Visualizing again, sorry. I did 1886, done dark, Poseidon um bilberry has been requested a lot but i'm not sure how the leather you know i gotta i, I would have to play with it 1912 of course was enigma released outside of the app no no that one was um app exclusive and I think there's still a, a few more left. <laughs> yes, and butter for Enigma. Yeah, I know. Butter, oil, balm for the Enigma profile. I have a bunch of ingredients on order, too. I'm just waiting for my pail of argan oil. It's been it's been on back order for like three weeks, and but I finally got a shipping notification yesterday or today, so I hope to have that early next week so I can make a huge batch of the carrier blend, which will allow me to do everything because I use the carrier blend in in the bombs, the butters, the oils, everything. So kind of had my hands tied right now, was running out of the uh, the blend making oils and just placed that humongous order for more bottles like 6,000 more of the one ounce bottles and another 3,500 sample bottles with the caps and all of that place that order today I should have that early next week why is there a fly in here Oh, did you see that? Straight did the Karate Kid style. <laughs> yes, Kevin, it is. Happy Friday to you. My woman loves the leather purse. That's awesome. That's awesome. Thank you. A lot of people have no idea all the swag, all the extra swag that I carry. I tried to make the website as easy as I could to navigate. So green zip up hoodies. Yes. <clears throat> I got to restock those. I just saw the fly again. Here's a, here's a dad joke for you guys. How can you tell if you have a country fly in your kitchen. How can you tell if you got a country fly in your kitchen? Chopsticks. It's the one on the range. Oh my gosh. I better not quit my day job. The one on the range. Terrible. I read a book the other day too called uh, Great Expectations. Wasn't all wasn't all what I expected. Crickets. Wow. All right. <clears throat> so let me think. Do I have anything else as far as the site goes? Working on those chakras. Have those done today. 1886. Oh, pine tar soap. Pine tar soap is back in stock. 
labeled, ready to go. Uh, I have more bottles on order too for the new, the co-wash, the new Citrus Blast. Freaking great profile. If any of you ordered it, let me know what you think. My first thought, I just used some the other day, <clears throat> creamsicle with the vanilla and the orange totally reminds me of the like the old fashioned orange creamsicles. So good. I appreciate the the laugh, Jason. <laughs> Once I get the argon in and mix up a big batch, I need to start refilling the uh, there's probably like five or six different staple profiles of beard bombs I'm out of a lot of the beard bombs um containers on order too i should have those next week i'm trying to find another vendor for the mustache wax the little because i like the matte black finish and the the vendor that i was getting the one ounce tins for the mustache wax just disappeared you know um I, I, I messaged him via email. He vanished. I had a phone number. No return call. So I don't know what happened if uh, Joe Bowden, you know, got to him or what. But I'm trying to source an affordable one ounce uh, satin black tin so they match the beard bombs for the mustache wax. Seems like I always have things to talk. Oh. Women's body splash. Yes. For your significant other, wife, girlfriend. I already have the base mixture that I need. I've got the bottles. I have the spray tops for them. I ordered like crap ton of different um, fragrances and essentials, blending up different things. So I hope to have the first run of women's body splash spray mist ready on or before Mother's Day. So that way, if you're picking something up for yourself, feeling a little guilty, go ahead and add a bottle of the uh, body splash, you know, for your your lady friend or for whatever your goat your cats, dogs. You know, if I'm making it, it's going to be good. I'm not going to put my label on it unless it's female approved. There's so many different profiles that I can make for the women's body splash too. So I think I'm going to do like a monthly runs you know like fictitiously speaking let's say like a lemon kiwi whatever you know that'll be like you know i'll make a big batch of it sell out for the month and then next month i'll do something else that way i can like always keep it fresh i've already done a little bit of research on like um, Victoria's Secrets, Bed Bath, Bed and Bath and Beyond, or Bed Bath and Body Works. Yeah, that Bath and Body Works. Trying to see like their top sellers and seeing if I can blend something up similar, but better. As you know, we've got to put the luxurious twist on it. So look out for those soon. I hope. And then of course I got to make, you know, it's coming up on summer. <clears throat> so I think the big, the big run blast off summer blend is going to be your favorite. Let's see. Let, let me see who, what, what do you think the summer blast off blend is going to be? It's one that I've already done. Let me see in the comments, whether you, right now or later you know if somebody's watching this later put down in the comments right now you can only put in once oh look at that gerard already got it
The good old Southern Bastard. Sunkissed. Uh, I'm just waiting for this. There's like three things I need for that one. Been on back order forever as well. That's why I took the Sunkissed off of the Cologne section. But yeah, I think I definitely want to do a run of the Sunkissed again when I can get it. Southern, the Southern bastard. It's all good, man. I'm a teller, terrible spieler. Tobacconist, everything, baby. I wonder how the tobacconist cologne would uh, would work. I'm afraid it might be like too similar to like 1886 with that whole like tobacco vanilla vibe. Yeah, so definitely southern. Um, I want to, I want to do some kind of like apple, pineapple, black pepper, something fresh, brand new. Um, then I got to look at my cookbook of other summer profiles that I did, see what else I can cook up. I definitely want to do a big run eventually of Enigma. I want to do. I think I'm going to do all three of the limited live stream oils, which let me try to pull that up, see if there's any left. So. 322 is gone. There's still a couple of the 329 and the 45 blend. 45 blend is freaking amazing. I took that with me when I went to Vegas recently. Got so many compliments on that. People asking what cologne I was wearing, so they always freak out when I tell them it's my my beard. They don't believe me. Wearing four or five as we speak. It's a great, great mix. What's up, Tom? Happy Friday. Adventurous Bastard is my favorite summer banger. It smells like Creed Aventus. Adventurous. I'll have to look at that and see if I can still do that one, but I know that one sold quite well. Mystery Oil, January 2024. That's a badass dude on the site. I got to look at that one as well. It's a problem with mixing so many crazy different stuff. I'm like, pew, 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 pew. I just got to make sure to write the stuff down because sometimes I'll blend it up and I will write it down on a piece of paper. And then I have to, you know, I'm like, oh, later I'll put it in, you know, on digits you know on my computer and my excel file and there's been a couple of profiles that i cannot find which sucks because i've done them as full runs in the past and now i have people asking me hey when are you going to do that and i went to go find it on digits not there looking through all my books so i gotta be a little bit better with that We definitely need tobacconist cologne. <laughs> Mr. Oil was a blend of red bastard and cool bastard. Yes. That was the January blend, right? I probably need to do more cool bastard just, you know, by itself. How about sexy? Should I bring sexy back? I'm sorry, guys. I, I had to do it. <laughs> bring in sexy back. 
anybody in here in the stream or watching this later, have you tried sexy? Sexy bastard. Some of the names are perfect because I think if somebody were to ask you, hey, what are you wearing? And it's like, oh man, that's almost like if I'm wearing something like that, I'm almost waiting for somebody to ask just so I can be like, yeah, I'm wearing my sexy bastard. They probably think you're joking. <laughs> you're like, no, it's really, it's the sexy bastard. <sighs> so good. Mm. Works well together. Maybe because it's matching cigar and cup. Oodberry. You guys like Oodberry over Billberry? Trying to pick a blueberry themed one for my dad. Hmm. I think I would go with Oodberry just because it's a limited run. So you can try it. Billberry is a staple. So that one I, I always try to restock often. So I would probably do Oodberry. I wore Oodberry yesterday morning to the gym. Very good. And you're, you're like the sixth person that's asked for a Blackbeard cologne. I'd have to, uh, I need to, I need to smell that one again and see if I can make that one work. I just remembered something right now. Okay. So the new co-wash, the citrus blast, uh, I was, you know, I love to blend. It's kind of like my favorite thing. And I started messing around with a, I guess I would consider it kind of like a ocean tr scent uh, that I think will work. I made myself a little prototype in the co-wash. So maybe in like a month or something after I do the citrus blast for a little while, I think I want to do this. I guess I'll call it like ocean ocean waves or something like that or ocean ocean mist <laughs> sounds like a feminine feminine product but i, I want to do a different version of that and then i think i'll do a <clears throat> kind of like a peppermint one i don't want to get too crazy because it's really hard keeping up with all the different versions of everything and trying to keep everything in stock the sailor bastard You just, uh, I just answered that one for you, Edgar. Well, make me the next Blackbeard cologne would be great. Sailor Bastard. Yankee, the Yankee Candle. The Yankee Candle Bastard. Ocean Breeze. Hmm, what else do I have for you guys? Your description of the ocean wash. <laughs> I have a description of the ocean wash. Nobody has claimed this, by the way. I think in one of the videos I did, the last one or the one before, it was the one that I pre-recorded it. I had told anybody that wanted this $100 bill, it's not real, but looks like it, and a signed Six of Diamonds, Mr. Luxurious, not like it's worth anything. But I, um, at the end of those recorded videos, I would usually tell people, hey, the first person that places an order in the notes section, if you put six of diamonds, you're going to get this card, this $100 bill, and a free bottle of oil. 
the free oil that I think it was the one that I just released over last weekend. I still have a few of those left. So it's up for grabs if anybody wants it. Vintage bastard. Yes. That was a sad day when I found out I could no longer get the stuff to make that. Sounds like a candle name. Oh, I gotcha. Ocean Mist. <laughs> sounds to me, it sounds almost like a feminine cleaning product. Summer's Breeze. Hmm. Well, I think that's about all I have to talk about. Um, it is 2.36. I got to finish uh, putting together the rest of the... Uh, Chakra colognes. Hopefully, maybe I can do some ombre colognes. <sighs> Anybody have any questions before I get back to work? As long as it's not math questions. See if I missed any comments here. Oh, orange wood. I think that would make a decent cologne as well. I've had a few people ask about it. Adventurous. I got to look into that one to see if I can still make it clean. The clean bastard. Man, I, I need to, to start taking notes myself in here. Best tobacco shop to order from online. Four nineteen blend. I know, right? I should have. <laughs> what? Can we have a million dollars? I don't have a million dollars. I got a hundred dollar bill. Orange was a very good profile. Just got. Just got mine today. So best tobacco shop. I usually get my stuff from Pipes and Tobacco or CigarsInternational.com. And they are not sponsoring any of this. I just sponsored by my uh, back pocket wallet. I was thinking about doing another one, but I kind of want to get the rest of the live stream deals out before I make another batch. But man, that would have been a good idea. Imagine if today was 420. Anybody into cryptocurrency? The Bitcoin having is tomorrow. So that's going to be cool to see what happens with Bitcoin and all other altcoins. I do like to dabble in a little bit of crypto Neptune cigars are good also Neptune I'll have to look them up well I think that's it better get my ass back downstairs 
get crackalacking on those colognes. I think I have enough time I can pull off the ombres. So thank you for joining guys, for joining in on my fantastical Friday freaking ran out of another F lounge. And thank you for everybody that's tuned in later to watch this video. Make sure to hit the thumbs up button because with the whole algorithm, you know, it helps and all that stuff. <sighs> that was for you, Scuba. Mm. And thank you, Brad, for the hookups. Much appreciated. And on that note, hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. Stay safe. And always, what's what's my catch line? Luxurious, get bastard. How does it go? Get luxurious, my friends. Have a good weekend. We will see you next Friday. Love you.